Hey, 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 what's up, YouTube? Welcome to Six Days. I am Bob Six, and I have something in my eye. Something besides my finger. See, if I was one of those phony channels, I'd edit that out, but I'm not. Today, I am doing Tom McDonald's new one, Clown World, and uh, Five Finger Death Punch. The Tragic Truth. If you knew the channel is what I do, real, genuine, unbiased reactions. I promise I'll never say that I like or act like I like something I don't. Before I get started, I got three things to tell you. Number one, in case you didn't know it, I have a Patreon channel, also entitled Six Days, but I will put the link below because people have problems finding it. And I do videos over there. I do not do here. They're strictly for my patrons, which includes Juice World. I just shot a new one for them today. Number two, someone found my one of my old channels. It's called Six Minutes, S I X X Minutes. I will put a card here and the link below. Either one will get you there. It's basically like my live streams, but in six minutes. When I reach 200 subscribers, I'll start releasing content again. Won't be big production. There'll be no green screen or anything like that. It'll be shot on my video, on my on my video, <laughs> on my phone, on my way home from work. So there'll be three videos a week released. It'll be on all sorts of things. Like I said, it's like a live stream. But to start, I have to pick a starting point. I'm going to do hidden messages in classic songs. See, once upon a time, we couldn't just say whatever we wanted to like you do now. So there's a lot of songs that your parents listen to, and maybe even your grandparents that are really dirty and they don't even know it. I'm going to expose all that stuff. And the third thing is, tomorrow, a lot of people have asked, my merch, a limited number of my merch, which is my six days logo on my shirt, I'm getting a limited number of them tomorrow. So if you're interested, hit me up on Instagram and we'll see about getting you one. It's first come, first serve. So let's get into this clown world. You worry about leaving a better planet for our kids. How about leaving better kids for our planet? Entire generation offended at everything, getting mad that a human thinks all lives matter. We don't need black or white or left or right. What we need is common sense. We need balance. We're all in the same boat. Why are you trying to make holes? If they sink, we sink. This is madness. I'm offended that you're offended by me taking offense. You can't build a wall. Why does your house have a fence? I believe in two genders. I'm not mad at the rest. I'm just confused when a dude has a beard and some breasts. We won't always agree. No, I don't. I'll stop it right there since he said it. Right off the bat, he something he's very good at is just, man, hitting it in the sweet spot with some truth. Now, granted, the gender part, I think people look at that differently than I do, and I'm not even going to hate on him for it. I don't hate on my friends for it. Do I think it's moronic what they say? Yes. But we're not here to discuss that. Maybe that'll be a topic on six minutes. Make sure you go subscribe to six minutes. Ooh, I'd love to address that. Hmm. Come on. Give me to that 200 subscribers over there. But Tom faces everything head on. Does that mean he hits home runs every time? No, he's put out some turds that I just could not stand. But man, when he's on point, he is on point. 29 seconds into the song and I had to stop to say just rapid fire truth right off the bat damn that's why he's still my favorite rapper I don't hate all police no nope. i don't think that the system's racist i just think the system hates people i think fighting violence with more violence is what they want viruses and riots people dying we won't stay home black lives matter all lives matter what's all this division for it's modern segregation this is setting up a civil war burn the circus down cause the world is full of clowns they're all stupid and they're proud painted smiles on their mouths i don't hang with bozos homie i can't be around you anyone who knows me knows my feet don't fit in clown shoes when i was a and for those of you that hate on Tom and I don't see what people see him, it's because you have your head buried in sand. You don't want to hear the truth. It hurts. It stinks. Ow. 
Mommy, the main man hurt me because he said the truth is not what I believe. <laughs> that don't mean everything he says is the truth, but a lot of it spot on. Man, love, love, love it. Child, the only races that we hated were the ones that we ran and didn't win. Then we stopped playing with each other, started hating on each other, started noticing the color of our skin. Christians and atheists, immigrants, patriots. We love the country, but we are not saving it. Wages don't raise to the rate of inflation, and half of the country hates all of the nation. It's funny that we think the world owes us something. All the phones got smart, but the people so dumb. We care more about the likes on a selfie than our moms, and the only time we ever speak the truth when we're drunk, we won't always agree. That's not something I do. I'll tell you the truth. I heard a lot of my friends' feelings. They'll ask me something. And they'll smile, but it sure stings. I had a friend who had recorded some music, and he asked, won my opinion of it. I asked him, do you want my opinion? Let me tell you what you want to hear. He said, I want your honest opinion. I gave it to him. I wasn't a dick about it. It just, it wasn't that good. He didn't speak to me for over a year Until he realized that I wasn't being a dick. I was being honest. And I was right about everything I said. It was, it was just, just my opinion. You asked for it. But everybody gets upset about that shit. They want you to lie. That's a big problem with my, my channel. See, the phony channels, there are several of them. Well, I mean, there's a lot. But there's one in particular that started after me. They have already almost doubled. No, they have more than doubled. Tripled. Now that I think about it, tripled my subscription rate. They're phony, but man, they're good at it. Well, and they only do a, a few artists. I, I could probably be more popular if I just released juice videos, but I'm not going to do that. Or juice reactions. I'm not going to do that. I want to be broader. But my being honest and not overreacting, I have people to get pissed off because I don't like Mac Miller. He's okay at best, or his music. To me, that's my opinion. I don't hate you for not liking Motley Crue or something else I like. It's my opinion, my taste. But so many people come here expecting to hear their opinion coming out of my mouth. And unless we just happen to have the same opinion, that's not going to happen. You know, all my videos are not are marked not made for kids. Not everybody can handle the truth. You can't handle the truth! Oh, I should put that video clip in there. You can't handle the truth! If you didn't see Jack Nicholson screaming, You can't handle the truth! You know, I decided not to do it. No, I don't hate all police. No, your thoughts and opinions ain't facts and they are not defining my reality. No, I think picking sides divides. It's probably what has got us here. United States is great regardless. That's what we forgot in here. Black lives matter. All lives matter. What's all this division for? It's modern segregation. This is shutting up a civil war. Burn the circus down. Cause the world is full of clowns. They're all stupid and they're proud. Painted smiles on their mouths. I don't hang with bozos, homie. I can't be around you. Anyone who knows me knows my feet don't fit in clown shoes. They tell you be yourself and then they judge you on the internet till everybody hates you for it. If Jesus was alive, I swear to God that y'all would cancel him. Cause lately being negative is the real new normal. Yeah, if you're thick, you're fat, you're rich, you're bad, you're poor, you're black, you're white, you're whack. They lie, it's facts. My generation needs a bunch of free condoms. Cause common sense ain't that common. This is what they wanted. This is how they planned it. This is to control every want on the planet. Then we put each other in caskets, protest and panic. And they take advantage to manage the damage. We won't always agree. No, nope, freedom doesn't come free. No, nope, there was people fighting, dying overseas. So that you get that freedom and be home. I think the elites are real, but they ain't drinking baby's blood. They're creating chaos, so they have something to save you from. Black lives matter, all lives matter. What's all this division for? It's modern segregation. This is setting up a civil war. Burn the circus down, cause the world is full of clowns. They're all stupid and they're proud. Painted smiles on their mouths. I don't hang with bozos, homie. I can't be around you. Anyone who knows me knows my feet don't fit in clown shoes. And there we go. And he is absolutely right. And the other thing is they censor us. Social media is as popular as this. Facebook will censor you. If you say something that they don't agree with as a whole, they put you in Facebook jail. YouTube. Because I happen to use the F word. You know, don't watch my videos if you don't like it. 
but you've noticed I've stopped doing that. I've pretty much stopped cussing at all. Occasionally a few will slip out, but I pretty much watch what I say because it went from recommending me from three to each one of my videos, recommending them to three million people per video down to 1.2. That's the only thing that's different. I'm still doing the same quality of video. I'm still doing the same music. Now, granted, they started blocking me a lot, which is not really 100% their fault, but then blaming me for not uploading like I'm supposed to. But I upload every, well, I shoot them all one day and I upload them throughout the week, but pretty much every day. So when you don't see a video every day, it's because I've been blocked. And the next one was blocked. And it takes 48 hours for it to get unblocked, if they unblock it. So censorship, and then blaming you for it. People keep letting the media tell them, this is how it is, and this is... When you can look around you and see that that's not true. All these people getting offended, like the whole Mr. Potato Head thing that just went on. Really? Really? Come on! It's a potato! You know, when I was in college, I heard a woman bragging to her friends that she doesn't let her kids watch Spongebob because they showed him in his underwear. Oh my God! A sponge in underwear? A cartoon sponge in underwear? <laughs> it's chaos, I tell you! Dumbass. People being proud of being dumbasses. Oh, great song. I, I really expected nothing less. Like I said, I don't like everything Tom has put out. He's put out some stuff I didn't care for. I like three or four right in a row that I didn't care for. But man, lately he has just been knocking them out of the damn park. Spitting truth all over the place. Which upsets a lot of people. <laughs> kind of like the fact that I'm not saying what you think I'm saying. Or I should say. So let's go on to Five Finger Death Punch and The Tragic Truth. six seconds in and I'm going to stop. That was damn. You know, a lot of people don't like the fact that I'm brutally honest or I don't say what they think I should say or I don't cry. I've actually had somebody get mad at me because I didn't cry at Eminem's Mockingbird. It didn't move me at all. But I got upset. I've seen other reactors cry. <laughs> if I feel like crying, something moves me to cry, I'll cry. But that song didn't do it. I am me, period. I sleep well at night because I'm not up here bullshitting you, saying what I know would get me views and subscribers. I'm paying the price for it, but I sleep well at night. I can't be on here crying because I can feel his pain. If I do feel his pain, I will cry. But if I don't, I can watch these phony reactors there's couples that do it. He gets to be the tough guy or a tougher guy. And she gets to cry or sometimes they both cry. You know, some people are moved easier than others. But once you watch enough reactors, I mean, I've steadily been just knocking reactors out of my subscription list. Because once I've watched them enough and I figure out they're phony, they're just doing it to get, give you what you want. And it's working for them. And that's great. I can't hate on him for that. It's just that's not who I am. So what he said is I have to face me in the mirror. And that's exact, man, that damn good song so far. 36, 36 seconds in and I had to say that. Demons I've created for myself The tragic truth It's hard for me to understand myself Holy shit. I've never thought about it like that. I warned my wife when we first started dating. I'm very difficult to, 
to be to live with. I have OCD, and there are certain things that I just zero tolerance for. Um, I I know, and I I can't help it. That's how I was brought up, or whatever has been in. So there's a lot of things about myself. As hard as I explore myself and try to control who I am, there are things about me that I. I mean, I know why they happen, but I can't control it. So for me to not be able to do that. Oh, I said I know. Uh, I know why it happens, but I don't know why I'm still that way. That's how I should have worded it. Because I try to be a better person. Struggle daily to be a better person. So if I can't understand why I can't fix some of the things that I have yet to fix, how can I expect another person, like my wife, we've been together for almost 28 years. April will be 28 years. We've been married for 25 She's learned a lot about me and knows a lot of things about me, but there's certain things that she still to this day doesn't understand, and I don't either. So, when you have something about you that you don't know, and you get mad at your, your parents, your wife, your boyfriend, whatever, because they just don't understand you, if you don't understand it yourself and you can't fix it yourself, how can you expect someone else to fix it or accept it? Damn, that is some deep-ass lyrics, man. Wow. Outstanding suggestion. Let me say something. I, I know I keep stopping this, but I'm hoping the hell it doesn't get blocked. I don't think I've ever reacted to Five Finger Death Punch, but a lot of the, the rock videos that I've tried to do end up getting blocked. So hopefully I'll break this enough, up enough that it won't get blocked. I cannot stand to hear someone say, the devil made me do it. You're taught that as a child, or you hear that as a child and you grow up. What that's doing is pointing the finger at someone else, taking the blame away from yourself for doing something shitty. But... Yeah, I, I can't stand it. Don't do that. You did it. The devil didn't make you do it. I mean, when you do something good, do you say, God made me do it? I know some people that do. They actually say, God put it on my soul. Anyways, man, this is an outstanding song. In the end, I made the choice and will not die ashamed. It's the voices screaming in my head. The tragic for me to understand myself so it has to be hard as hell for you you yeah. are we born to be broken sinners and someone tells the heavens I'm ready to escape yeah. this is not what I wanted not what I take it all tear it all rip it all away take it all tear it Take it all, tear it all away. 
holy shit this may be one of the first videos that's got me amped up with both songs the Tommy Donald song just it kicked ass straight truth I didn't agree with 100% of what he said in the song but the majority of it I did this song very personal I mean a personal level outstanding and I wasn't sure how it was going to work to put in Tom McDonald with five finger death punch but damn outstanding and if you didn't like either one of them too bad they were both asked for and I've done them and I'm I'm amped up I'm actually trying not to act like those ah, people on the other channels the fake channels but I'm that pumped up over those. Both of those were outstanding songs. Hey, if you're still here and I haven't pissed you off already, well, if I pissed you off, you wouldn't be here. But if you haven't done it yet, I appreciate it if you hit that red subscribe button right there. It doesn't hurt. It doesn't cost anything. And I'll never call you at home to ask you to extend your subscription. Click that bell so you know every time I release new content. I truly appreciate y'all hanging out, especially if you're still here after that, because I know this was a long one. Have a great day. Make someone laugh if you get the chance. Don't forget to tell your friends and family each and every time you leave that you love them. Because you just never know when that's going to be the last chance you get to tell them. Stay safe, people. We are living in some crazy ass times. I am Bob Six. Peace.